breath of God is worse. Use his words to teach and counsel each other. Sing psalms. Sing psalms. Meaning, in our singing choir, listen to me. Sing word. Sing the word. The reason you have people in the, in the music ministry today, they are trying to copy the word and paste it with Christ. And package, and package the lyrics of the word and put Jesus inside to make it sound gospel-like. If you don't have it, you can't sing it. So all the rubbish we are hearing today, they call gospel music. Anytime somebody sings something in the world that is trending, the next thing you start seeing, you see a gospel minister wants to start sounding like it. Listen to me. If you have the word in you, you will sing and sing and sing and sing. You can't exhaust it. Sing psalms. Sing psalms. Don't sound like the world. Sing psalms. Pray psalms. And hymns. We don't just sing any kind of song. We sing spiritual songs. And some of you right now, if I begin to check your phone, you are indicted already. I say, open your music file. Let's check. The kind of thing we will start hearing, we will have to excuse you. Because you wake up in the morning with songs that are enough to distort your day. How can somebody like that guy, they, are, uh, they call, I've forgotten his name, sing a song? You see the way his life is. Listen, whatever you are hearing from him is a product of what is inside of him. And that is the song you hear every time. Look at the, uh, uh, the portable. And that, listen, after some times, you just see your life start looking like that. Sings psalms and hymns and spiritual songs to God with thankful heart. Look to God. 